Welcome to this video segment that talks about how to set up mobile hotspots using the new BlackBerry Z10 phone. Now before we go onto the demo, I'd just like us to quickly go through some of the features of the mobile hotspot. And the, the good thing is that it, it supports eight devices now instead of five in the in the former phones the new phones support up to eight devices which could include your e-reader your tablet PC your laptop or any other device okay so that is very good another good feature about the mobile hotspots is that you can also adjust the inactivity time now in the former operating system the time was fixed which was just 15 minutes but with the new operating system you can actually adjust the time from 5 minutes to 60 minutes but bear in mind the, the longer the, the inactivity period the more battery life your phone would use so just be careful of that okay now although I love the features of, of, of the mobile hotspots one sh shortcoming is that it only supports wireless BNG networks and not wireless N. I guess it could also be due to a, a, a power thing but uh, that is something which I wish it had supported which was wireless N but for now it supports wireless BNG. Okay so with this let us go straight into the demo and let's see how we can set it up for ourselves. Thank you. gentlemen this is the Z10 BlackBerry phone running BB10 and I'm going to show you how to set it up so that the mobile hotspot will work well so without any waste of time let's go straight to it you click on tap on settings when you tap on settings you look for network connections you tap that. When you tap that, you go down to mobile hotspot. As you can see, it's not connected. When you tap that, the next screen shows you the the introduction of about how the mobile hotspot works. You click on next. Again, it gives you a warning that charges may apply. Click on next. And the next screen talks about monitoring hotspot users. Again, that's some information that you want to read. Click on next. The warning about battery. Um, as we all know, mobile hotspot consumes a lot of battery on your phone, so be sure that you have it fully charged before you start. And always have your charger with you at all times when you're doing. Um, or when you're implementing the mobile hotspot. So we click on next. Okay, and just like what we had in the previous BB7, if it's not used, if there's no activity after 15 minutes, the hotspot functionality would be disabled or turned off. Okay, so the next step here is to set up your mobile hotspot password in this case we're going to create a uh, 8 character password for that so for the sake of this exercise I'm going to use a very simple password I'm going to show it so that we all see it so I'm just going to call it A S D F one two three four. Okay, as you can see that you can use this to confirm. A S D F one two three four, and then next. So we connect, connecting, 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 and then you now have. Your hotspot name, which is your BB hotspot 3807, and currently it is on, as you can see. Now, let us go to 
a tablet PC here. This is actually a Google Nexus tablet PC. And we're going to connect this now to the hotspot. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to come here. We really select your Wi-Fi options. And down here, you will soon see. Let's give it a while for it to show up. Okay, good. So right here we have the hotspot here. Okay, and as you can see, it's the signal is full. I'll click on the hotspot. I'm going to put the password. Remember the password we used before, which is this. Okay, and then we're going to connect. As you can see here, it's connected. Right, it's connected, and the signal strength is quite good. What I'm now going to do is I'm just going to go to, let's say, um, the browser, and right here, we're now using the browser which of course is getting its data from the tablet I mean from the BB10 phone so in a few minutes you will see that popping up and we should be good to go so right here we have we have the tablet PC now getting its data from the Phone. Right here we have the phone, and we have the device that's connected to it, and it's active. So I hope we we now have an idea how to connect or set up the mobile hotspots on our BB10 device. Thank you. none which of course we won't we won't do that's the password that's the band type where you have um 802.11 g and bg unfortunately this doesn't support um 802.11 n which is a pd but that's what that's what blackberry gave us and we also have the inner the inactivity timer by default is set to 15 minutes we can increase it or decrease it okay and that is basically all about configuration this is useful when you want to change the password if you feel that your password is compromised or you might want to change that pass password to to something else all right so that is basically the properties of of the mobile hotspot using um, your z10 or a z10 blackberry phone